Hey guys, welcome to another one of our reviews. I'm Worm, this is the Pro Rotor. Uh, today we're going to be doing another juice review of which we did receive free of charge. We got this from Dr. Smokeless. Uh, it's a Facebook group also, they have their own shop as well. Uh, but they supply it, it's Julian and Kerry, Kerry. I believe, yeah, Kerry. Um, they sent us these down to review, so we're reviewing them. Jobs are good. Um, what we're doing today, guys, is it's a weird one, Mr. Smoke Liquids, sold it's sold by Dr. Smokeless, um, so they've sent it down just to have a little go of. Um, so what we're doing is the Mr. Smoke Butterscotch um, E-Liquid, 24 milligram strength this one guys, so it's a bit higher than we typically aim for. Uh, we'll gloss over a few bits and bobs, nice little bit of labelling, tactile labels, ship compliant labels, all that stuff you come to expect. Um, there's obviously your, uh, your child safety caps on this one. Uh, sort of no needle on this one, just going back to the old school style of bottles with them ones, but um, I don't mind them to finish when filling cave ones, it's a lot quicker. Um, price on these ones guys, lovely and cheap, £2.40 for 10 mil, so they are cheaper than liquids, um, especially for the UK side of things anyway. So, Sorry guys, getting up my nose, but it's a bit of nicotine going on. <laughs> Obviously this is, a, this is a 24 milligram strength, they just sent us through what they had uh, on their side at the time, varying strengths and that, so we've got all different strengths going on. Uh, 24 bar scotch. Wow, the nicotine is uh, <laughs> it's what you expect from a 24, I suppose. Um, I normally make 12, so bear in mind that. Oh, sorry, it's tickling my nose a little bit. <laughs> um, but scotch, yes. Yes, it does taste like butterscotch. scotch. Um, it's not something that I actually eat or vape very often, um, but I know what it tastes like. Um, yeah, it's, it's uh, sweet. And it tastes like butterscotch. I mean, there's not really much to to it. I mean, I'm not getting so much creaminess, but I think that maybe because it's in the 24. Um, but that's just me. I'm getting a very massive nick hit off of this one. <laughs> it's strong. <isn't> it? mm. <laughs> um, no idea what PGVG ratio is, guys. I'm looking here and I can't see it, but um, high 70% PG, I'd imagine. <coughs> around that mark anyway. Um, yeah, throw it off a 24 for me, guys. That's a, that's an eight for throw it. That's a big one. Um, I don't vape 24. Though. I always vape half that typically. So just be aware. Um, for me, I'm getting kind of um, a sweet butteriness after the throw it's gone, obviously, and it's almost like a, a very mild. It it reminds me of coconut. It doesn't necessarily taste like coconut. But it reminds me on the tongue that kind of the aftertaste you get of coconut, that sweetness, weight lies, it kind of reminds me of that, but with like buttery and it's all tied into it. Um, but it definitely tastes it tastes like a butterscotch should do. It's kind of mild, I'm getting a little bit of a creamy, creamy butteriness is what I'm being left with now. Not bad at all. Um, yeah, we, just to hash over guys, these are available in several strengths. Um, zero, eight milligram, 18 milligram, 24 milligram and 36. So if you're the midway between the sort of 12 milligram vapor, um, you're not gonna get your 12 unfortunately, but you could always have a little mix up between some zero and some 18 and get around a nine, um, depending on what ratio we're using. But that is what it is. Um, we do two marks guys out of 10, one for what we think it's supposed to taste like, i.e. does it taste like it's label, and then one for our personal take on the liquid. So, um, okay. Yeah, it, it tastes like butterscotch to me. I mean, um, I think the nicotine hit is taken away from the creaminess from me because I don't vape higher than 12 ever. Whereas Mr. Brown does occasionally jump to like an 18 or a 24 depending on what he's doing. Um, so yeah, um, I'm, I'm losing a bit of creaminess but this where my palate's not used to the high nicotine strength anymore anyway. Um, but yeah, it tastes like butterscotch, it's a 10. Um, yeah, I mean I, th I think it tastes like butterscotch as well said that the nicotine definitely draws, the higher the nicotine the less flavour you get, it's well known. Um, the nicotine is definitely drawing my attention away from the flavour a little bit, but no, it definitely does taste like a butterscotch. In my nicotine strength, I think I'd be quite enjoying this one. Um, so I'm going to give it a 10 for it tasting like butterscotch. Yeah, uh, for me personally, this is like a 9. It's kind of, the sweetness is just about right. Uh, can't really taste the creaminess. Like, I, I can feel it on my tongue, but it's not a, like a taste of it that I'm getting. So that would be the reason that, that hopefully in the 12, I could, it would probably come through a lot better. I mean, nicotine does tend to overpower a lot of the subtle flavours like cream and stuff like that. So. Hopefully in the 12 this would be a lot better for me, but as it stands now, it's about a 9. I could vape this if I needed to, but I wouldn't pick up a 24, so just bear in mind, get it in the strength if you want it in. There you go. And um, for me, I'm going to give this one, I'm going to give this one an 8. Um, I'd like a little bit more flavour in it, to be honest with you. It's, it's, it's a fairly strong flavour. It's just one of them things with butterscotch is very, very sickly and very, very over the top with flavour when you're having butterscotch. Um, so I would like a bit more. 
<laughs> to, to make it more reminiscent of a, a true butterscotch. The flavour's there, but I want, it, I want more of it, do you know what I mean? So for me it's going to be an eight, um, but it's actually a nice liquid. If it was stronger, I probably couldn't do it all day, whereas in my strength, I could probably do this all day. Um, it's a very sort of dessert style, as it should be being that butterscotch, but um, yeah, I'm going to give it an eight. I think it's quite nice. So that is what it is. Um, obviously, guys, Dr. Smoke will be linked down there at the minute. It's just a Facebook group. They have said that um, if you want to purchase from them, these liquids from them, they're quite happy to do that and ship them out to you. It's not a problem. It's something they're just venturing into doing, um, but they're more than happy to do it for you. Um, and obviously, the shop as well, so awesome sauce. Um, thank you very much for watching, guys. I've been Mr. Proton. This has been The Worm. See you soon.